West Ham corner. Brinier's dot here, gets there and nods home, does she? No. Referee Abigail Byrne has seen a, a foul in there and I think for me, Kim Little goes down to the deck far too easy. That goal should have stood. Asayi. Brinier's dot here, oh. Not quite on the same wave length as Keybag, and neither's Catley and Zinsberger, and they're made to pay. Terrible defending, but full credit to West Ham United, capitalising on the mistake. And it's their main go to girl, Danye Brinier's Dottier, with a simple tap home. Arsenal nil, West Ham won. Manager Jonas Adeval will not want to watch that one back. Mead. Blackstenius. Mead! Powerful strike. Excellent save from the teenager in the West Ham goal. It's the first glimpse that Beth Mead's had of the opposition penalty area. Nobs! The substitute with an immediate impact replaces the captain, Kim Little. 75 seconds later, draws her side level. Arsenal won, West Ham United won. Free kick, Black Stenius. Very simple. Arguably too simple from a West Ham United perspective, but Stina Blackstenius will not care a jot. It's her first league goal since the opening day of the season. And Arsenal in front. Can they secure a two-goal cushion? Blackstenius is held up. Ford ah, doesn't fancy the first-time strike. McCabe. Eventually persistent pays. And Arsenal do have their two-goal advantage. For me, Caitlin Ford should have taken this strike on first time, but the Australian hesitated. You could argue maybe had the moment goal passed, but three. McCabe's From floated Arsenal. in delivery, Score. and the Norwegian Five scores her third goal the in her last three Arsenal appearances to make it Arsenal three, West Ham Arsenal. one. West Ham still trying to create. Brinier's dot. Yeah, oh! Zinsberger. Double reactions from the Austrian. Denies the first attempt and pushes away. And he tap in for West Ham. Marnham. She's got Hurtig in support. Marnham! Should have made it for full time. Arsenal 3, West Ham 1.